So one of the latest and hottest accessories for the JL interior we offer is the tailgate table. First step, we're gonna wanna check our instructions and verify that we have all of our included hardware and then get our tools that we're gonna need together. For this installation, we're gonna need a drill, a half inch drill bit, a four millimeter Allen wrench, and 10 millimeter open end wrench. If you don't have an auto trim puller or like me, you can't find yours, you can use a small pry bar. Just be hyper aware not to mar the finish on the tailgate. The first step in this install is gonna to be to remove the factory trim panel. You'll take your trim panel tool or pry bar very carefully and go around the panel to release the clips. Once you get a couple of them removed, you should be able to fit your fingers in and pull the rest out. There's the location of the clips. We are looking at the rear of the panel to these access points. We've got this one here and then the far side, another one here. We're gonna be drilling a half inch hole at each one of these points. From the factory, the JL has threaded bosses here, 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 and here. These are gonna be the attachment points. But to get to those, we have to go through the panel. So we'll be drilling the holes, adding a sleeve and a bolt. The lower portion of the panel is marked with a small dimple here and also here we'll be drilling a half inch hole in these locations also. If for some reason your panel does not have these markings, then you're gonna need to reinstall the panel, place the table in the correct position and mark the outside of the trim panel. And now I'm just gonna simply drill out these two access points at the top. Flip the panel so this one's closer to me. And then again, on the bottom, we've got a dimple here. I'm center my drill bit on that. And dimple mark there, same thing. Now we're ready to reinstall the factory trim panel. When you pull the panel off, some of these clips may stay on the tailgate. Remove the clip and find where it came off of, which is here. And reinstall it in the panel. Now it's just a matter of having the panel right side up and reinstalling it onto the tailgate. making sure that our drill points match our threaded bosses in the tailgate, and they do. So now let's get the hardware. So there are two different size spacers included with the table kit. Where you have four of the smaller. These are the ones we're using with the JL. The larger are for a different application and won't be used. Simply take the spacers and insert them where we drilled the half inch holes. Careful that they don't fall into the door. Now we're gonna take our table, unlatch it, fold the table out. I'm gonna take the upper snubber and bolt, run the bolt through it, through the hole in the table through the spacer and thread it into the tailgate. And tighten these down.
Now that we have the top of the table mounted securely, we're going to remove the bolts at the hinge points so we have access to the lower mounts. To do that, we'll need the four millimeter Allen wrench and 10 millimeter boxing wrench. Now, when you separate these two, it's a Teflon bushing that you need to make sure you don't lose. Do that to the other side and then we'll be able to attach the lower mounts. So now I've got the hinge bolts removed from the table. I am just gonna carefully set it out of the way so that I have access to the lower mounts. Let's see. The lower mounts are also gonna use a six millimeter by 50. They also have a washer. We'll put the washer on the bolt. And now we are going to line up the lower mount with the spacer and the access hole. Get that threaded into the factory boss on the tailgate. Do the same for the other side. There we go. The upper is attached, but it's not tight so that we have movement to adjust the lowers. Get those started. So we've got all four of the mounting bolts tightened by hand and you could continue with the Allen wrench to tighten them, but through the miracle model, modern technology, I don't have to. Arr, get off there. Our base is securely mounted to the tailgate. Now we're gonna reattach the actual table portion and we'll be one step closer to being finished. So you'll start your bolt through the Teflon bushing on there. Bring the tabletop up, through, and secure your lock nut. Take your 10 millimeter, your four millimeter, I'm gonna snug this up. You don't have to crank down on it. It has to swivel. It's the hinge. But you want it snug. Repeat on the left side. So we'll do bolt bushing through the tabletop. Secure the nut and tighten down 10 millimeter, no, 10 millimeter and the four millimeter. Last thing left to do is to add the rubber snubbers, say that three times really fast, to the top mounting bolt position. And the installation of the JL tailgate table is complete. Got a work surface capable of holding up to 75 pounds. Place to put a tumbler. The JL tailgate table is a great addition to any Jeep, whether a hardcore off-roader or a tailgating daily driver.